Welcome to a day in a life with a girl with 10 vending machines. So you guys, I'm back with a vlog, okay? First of all, we got so much to do in this vlog. I hope you guys are excited that I'm dropping a vlog. If you're new here, my name is Rika. Not only do I help people start businesses, and I have been since 2019, I also currently have 10 vending machines in six different states, so. First thing on the agenda for today, which today's agenda has been crazy, you guys. Y'all, mind y'all, it's 1.11 p.m. Your girl has not ate all day because I was fasting. And then when I woke up, I have to deal with one of my mentees because I also help people find locations. Well, not at this moment, but I am currently helping people find vending machine locations. That was the service I had offered. So one of my mentees, I'm currently helping her. So I was like contacting the malls, updating her, following up and stuff like that. So I did that. Now, I'm about to go to Smoothie King because y'all know I love Smoothie King. I'm about to go get me a smoothie. After that, we are about to go to one of my vending machine locations. And then we are also going to be putting our business cards in places. Even though my business card is kind of messed up, y'all probably can't tell. But um, they're supposed to be getting redone like my picture is cut off and stuff but we're not gonna throw out the business card so we gotta let the people know that i got 10 vending machines period we gotta promote our business because at the end of the day only you can promote your business it's people out here that don't know who i am and they need to know who i am they need to shop support and they might want to start businesses too because you know like i help people start businesses so if you want to start a business you know where to go i tasty.com and I also had somebody book a business phone call, period. So shout out to her business call pending. So I gotta check to see what time she booked for for today. I just love it, I love it, I love it. I love that y'all are tapping in. Y'all are, you know, valuing my time. Shout out to her for booking her phone call. So we about to get into it. If you are booking a phone call with me, please make sure that you have all of your questions and concerns ready for the business call is for anybody that needs help with anything you want to discuss business with me yeah so enough of the talking enough of the chatting i haven't spoke to you guys in so long but i'm excited to drop this vending machine vlog for you guys so make sure you watch this video all the way through um make sure you like if you're new make sure you subscribe and we about to get straight into Our smoothies so this is the hulk vanilla if you drink smoothies comment what you drink below i just love smoothie king so much the hulk is my favorite one honestly y'all i be getting the one with coffee too but i was like nah because i've been getting that almost every day and i don't want like my caffeine intake to be high because i'm not even a coffee drinker so this is what we're drinking today and we about to head straight to the ball hey y'all so we are at brunswick square my location is literally right outside the macy's if you live in this area so i usually come to this entrance my machine used to be on the other side which is like around here by the jc pennies that was my first location but i like this location over here better because as y'all see like it's a lot of cars out here already i gotta talk loud because y'all know in the malls they be playing music and i don't want to have to mute this whole segment out because the whole point was to you know show my vending machines for you know people that want to get into vending machines but anyway i literally just stocked this machine up literally last week but there are some empty spaces so shout out to people that have been shopping but i came here last week because i had to make sure that these pouches fit because this is the new item so these are it has lashes it has a spoolie and it has lip gloss so i had to make sure like you know it fit in the compartment before i went ahead and did a bulk order so that's why i have some of them here but yeah. be taking out all of these lashes you guys because i want this to be the new product not just the regular lashes so i'm gonna be taking all of these out and that's why i brought these um empty post office boxes because i'm literally about to pop these on the website for discount because i want the machine to just be um press on nails in these pouches and then i do have some stuff like in storage because as y'all see the vending machine has storage and stuff like that y'all have probably seen more behind the scenes if you got my vending machine starter pack bundle which i will be recording for you guys today so mad i left my tripod but if you want to get into vending machines i did create a starter pack bundle i created this bundle and matter of fact y'all what's crazy this is my very first vending machine so this is my not my first machine this is my first location so this was my first mall location I've been here for a year and a half 
So I'm super grateful for them for giving me this opportunity. But I created a starter pack bundle a year ago for anybody that wants to get into vending machines. And you literally have everything that you need in a bundle. My personal vendor is included, how to contact malls, how exactly I contact malls, how I secured all my locations. And what is crazy for those of y'all that are new, I stopped at vending machine number five. Like if you've been watching my channel, I told y'all I was done after five machines. But after machine number five, the opportunities came. Montana was offered to me. All the rest of my locations were all offered to me. So that is why I kept going because they were offering it to me. So might as well, we're not gonna miss out on you know expanding our business or whatever. And I also feel like it's God's way of showing me my purpose because I feel like for a long time I was struggling to know what my purpose was. Like I went to school to be a teacher. I've always wanted to be a teacher. I've always wanted to be an entrepreneur, but I get to help people do what I'm doing. Creative and hook y'all onto stuff. So I'm about to clear these lashes. And like I told y'all, I'm also recording for Instagram. So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. And what's crazy is this lady just came up to me and said she follows me, period, okay? The girl from Tim vending machines making rounds. Like, this vending machine stuff, like, y'all, I promise I never saw myself doing something like this. I saw myself being a CEO, but the whole vending machine thing, like, coming, stocking up, I never saw this for myself. The fact that I figured out all of this on my own, I could do it, you could do it. What's, what's stopping you? And you have everything you need. The starter pack got my vendor there, so you could contact her and get a quote, because she has all types of machines. She ships everywhere. Mm. Oh, wow, y'all, my arm looks extra greasy. <laughs> I put shea butter on. That's why it looks hella greasy. But it went and now I'm just taking out all of these lashes. Super easy. Super, super, super easy to take the stuff out the machine. So I'm just getting out all of these lashes. And I'm like I said, I'm literally about to pop these on my website. Like the entire box is gonna be discounted just so somebody could purchase it and it could be gone. And then we're gonna put the lash kits on this side. But I honestly don't have enough lash kits to fill up the entire machine. But it's cool because like I said, I need to get rid of these lashes anyway. Because I want, you know, I want this to be the standard, okay? You feel me? I want that to be the standard. I think I'm gonna leave the butterfly lashes just so this machine can have some variety. So I think I'm gonna, I'm kinda gonna rearrange it. So maybe, um, Maybe all of this will be press-ons and then this will be lash kits and then the top row will be butterfly lashes. I think that's what I'm gonna do. But then again, I don't really know how many um, butterfly lashes I have, but we'll see. So y'all, I already put the butterfly lashes in there. Now I'm trying to put the lash kits in the machine. Get this together. I'm excited, my machine's all organized now. Okay, we got the press ones, we got the butterfly lashes. And let me know in the comment section what other videos that you guys want me to do. Cause like, I already know what my next YouTube video is, but I really don't know what topics. Because I have a lot of content on this channel. Like if you're new here, Definitely go back and watch because you can watch my entire business journey from when I was struggling to finish college, working my nine to five, living in my parents' house. I started my business in a corner of my room. And if you wanna be inspired, you can definitely be inspired by watching my YouTube business journey. That's documented on here. So that way you can be inspired to see that anything that you wanna be in life, you could be in life. I was not the popular girl in school. I don't have nobody helping me with my business. I don't have nobody telling me what to do. I'm literally somebody that wanted to start a business, took that leap of faith, started the business, and here we are almost five years later. Now I've branched off into vending machines. I've branched off doing other things. I mentor people. So definitely be sure to check out my channel out. Progress, y'all. 
So these are the lash kits, lash lip gloss kits. And then I'ma fix the press-ons, butterfly lashes at the top. And then I already like dumped the lashes. Yeah, gonna... can nobody say that they are responsible for my business's success? Like I worked hard, I made mistakes. Of course, y'all know business is an up and down cycle. You win some, you lose some. You make money, you lose money. It's not always perfect. Oh, so these are all the kits I was able to fit in there. Like I told y'all, starting the vending machine is very, very easy. <laughs> Very, very easy. The people that purchased my starter pack, they was like they wanted a stocking video. I'm like, y'all, stocking is so easy. Okay, it's so, so, so easy. So we got the butterfly lash, we got those, and now I'ma kinda just move these around. I actually do have press-ons in the car that I might go get that I need to use up. So I think I'ma put those in these spots because I do have press-ons in the car. But like I said, I wanna empty out this storage because there's no point to have all of these lashes and stuff sitting here because that's money sitting down, okay? So that's what we gonna go ahead and pop. This is my favorite part because y'all, I don't even know how this happened. This must have just happened when I was stocking up and stuff. So we are about to clean our window. Well, that's one thing I always do when I stock my vending machines and that's another tip for you guys. Make sure you always have Windex. I usually always have Windex in my car, but I don't know why I have been forgetting because I've been like all over the place lately. But yeah, so I borrowed this from Air Postel. I gave her a free pair of lashes, so shout out to her. So I'm about to open it back up, clean this off, and then we about to stock up. Hey, you guys. So right now I'm at a mall called Woodbridge. What's crazy, a, 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 little, a little sidebar, this mall, I was trying to get my vending machine in here for the longest and they said no. <laughs> I was reaching out to this mall forever. Like anybody that has a vending machine, y'all know the location is the hardest part. People be thinking it's so easy until they actually try to get a location. And then now you see how I went almost two years without a location. Of course, now I figured out a method to it and that's why I help. Uh, well, I was helping because I no longer have the service available so where I secure locations for people just because I am in the process of moving. Um, and then I also have just so many things going on. I still run an online business. Okay, I don't just have vending machines. I also am running an online business as well. So I don't have the time. So if you missed out, I'm sorry. But there was a time where I was securing locations for people as well. But people think it's so easy to secure locations until you actually have to sit down and do it. And then you realize how hard it is. So this was a location that I tried to get into for a minute they turn me down but it's fine because we still got 10 other locations anyway but anyways we about to put business cards on cars so i'm really trying to work on like speaking to people like that's my next step when i get like my official official business cards because i like struggle with social anxiety and like i spoke on this before my business has gotten me out of my shell so like when i finished like after high school and stuff i did go to cosmetology school and whatever when I used to do hair, I had to like get out of my shell to like being an entrepreneur brought me out of my shell, like forced me to talk to people. But I've been online for so long, like my business is about to turn five. So now I'm trying to get to the place where I'm not just relying on social media to promote my business. I want to actually promote it in person. So this is like a step for me. So I'm putting my business cards in places. And then from there, I'm like gonna start like, you know, actually handing them to people and speaking to people and stuff like that. But this is just a start. So it's a lot of cars here and that's what we're about to do. And then that's all like we're literally um about to do today because it's already 3.42 and I'm very thirsty. Like I'm still not done with my smoothie. But when I get the 32 ounce, I usually never finish it anyway. And I want to chug the rest of this water and drink another one. But it's like, I'm going to have to use the bathroom. So I'm going to just wait till I get back. But I'm going to just put my business cards on the cars that I see out here. And then I'm going to drive around because this mall is big. It's not big, but it's big. So I'm going to drive around, put some more cars out just to feel accomplished. You know, just to feel accomplished for the day. So we went to the vending machine. The last thing I got to do is put these lashes on the website. Then, of course, I got to edit this vlog for you guys. Then, of course, I have to um, do my voiceover. And then I also have content to record for my personal page. So let me know what kinds of videos you guys want. Do you guys, because I don't know if y'all still want, like, my other vlogs that I used to upload showing, like, actual days in my life. Because I look at the engagement. I look at the commenting. When I upload business tip videos is when people actually engage. When I do day in my life videos... 
the engagement is not the same and that's why I'm no longer uploading those kinds of videos as much as I started to like recording vlogs I look at the engagement okay I look at who's supporting who's commenting and when I look at my videos the comments is on the business tip video so how should what, what are we gonna do to see who supports so if you watch this video all the way to this point and so that I know that you are a true supporter comment what your favorite food is because at the end of the day people claim they watch my videos if you didn't leave a comment you didn't watch the video because that's how I know who watches my videos because I respond to all my comments if you watch this video all the way to this point y'all not it's raining and I know that you are a true supporter so I know that you're a true supporter comment your favorite food I have a few different favorite foods I love steak I love pasta I'm a pasta girl I love mashed potatoes and mac and cheese as my sides so I have a lot of favorite foods I just don't eat seafood so comment what your favorite food is so I know that you're a supporter comment what kind of videos you want me to do and let me show y'all all the cars out here as y'all see it's a decent amount of cars y'all but it's raining it's raining it's raining it's raining thank you guys so much for watching this vlog a day in the life with the girl with 10 vending machines you already know what to do if you want to start a business or get into vending machines link in the description box be sure to follow on instagram it's the same name as all platforms and we also have a business phone call so need help book a call i'll see y'all on the next one bye